Hello, today I would like to tell you about Thomas Alva Edison. This slide is presented to you by Becky Velez, Jasmine Saveda, Josh Rivers, and me, Humphrey Brocious. Work was completed at STEM Civics High School, Charter School and under the supervision of Dr. Lay. Who was Thomas Edison? Thomas Edison was a famous inventor. He was born on February 2nd, 1847 in Milan, Ohio. He was the youngest of seven children. While his father was a political activist from Canada, and his mother, Nancy, was a school teacher. During his attendance in public schools for only 12 weeks, he was hyperactive and easily distracted, so he was deemed difficult by his teachers. So then his mother pulled him from school and taught him at home using her own experiences. How was his personal life? His mother taught him at home, while most of his education came from reading R.G. Parker's School of Philosophy and the Cooper Union for the Advancement of Science and Art. He, later in his life, he founded 14 companies and had five children. He had two wives, Mina Miller and Mary Stilwell. Thomas's ded dedication. If he was alive today, he would be perceived by society as a genius to all. Out of the factory, he was always attentive in thinking about his work. Thomas was, a very, persist was very persistent and never gave up on invention. Professional career. He started his career as an inventor in Newark, New Jersey with the automatic repeater. The first invention that gave him attention was the invention of the phonograph in 1877. It recorded on tin foil around the groove cylinder. Edison's major invention was the first industrial lab. Thomas Edison introduced electricity in commercial applications like stores and factories. Most successful inventions, the phonograph, motion picture camera, magnetic iron ore separator, carbon microphone, and the electric power meter. Least successful invention, the iron ore separator, pneumatic stencil pin, and electrographic voting machine. Innovations, the industrial research lab, electrograph voice recorder, and the galvan galvanic batteries. These are our references. And thank you for taking your time to listen.